Today's video regarding Canon Pixima TS5000 series printer. I'm going to show you how to do the Wi Fi direct setup. So, so this is the inbuilt Wi Fi system of the printer, and we just have to uh, activate that and we have to find out the password of that, and then we can connect it with any device. For example, I have iPhone here. Now, the first step is to switch on the printer. On the display panel, we just have to simply go to the setting option and click OK. Click on the setting. Click on the device settings. Go to the LAN setting. Click OK. And here we see wireless direct. Click OK. On the top it says wireless direct activate inactivate. Click OK. And we have to switch it on. So click on. So it will take some time to switch it on. So on the next screen it, it will and here it says password information is included in the next screen and to display that click yes and here we can see the SSID that is the direct TS5000 series so that is the name of this Wi-Fi of the printer and here we look for the password so here I go to the iPhone and open the Wi-Fi it will display the name of the printer here 5000 series click on that enter the password as it was displayed on the and click on the join button and wait for the Wi-Fi to connect so once it is connected you can see here go and open the Canon print app you can download this app from the app store so once you open the app it will simply ask do you want to search for available printers so just click yes and it will automatically add up the printer for you here now here it says printer could not be found so just click ok and once you click ok it will dis after some time it will display the Canon TS5000 series here click on that now it's going to add the printer here and in the end you will see this screen so just click on the cancel button and once you see the printer is added here so for example we can do the scan so click on the scan button open the top scanner lid so here we place a page facing downwards on the left hand side corner close it and go to your app and click on the scan button here we can see the scan has arrived as you can see and if you want you can add more pages or just you can simply click on exit and once you click on that here we can see the scan has arrived and we can share it or save it you can also change it into a PDF or JPEG if you want go and save it to a file click on the save to files and here you can save wherever you want and you can just click on the print which is for the Canon and click on the save button and go back And same way you can do the printing as well in for example go on the document print section and click on the documents and as you can see we simply just scanned a copy right now so open that and click on the next one and click on the print button and it will send a command for the printer to print so I'm just cancelling right now so overall I can say the printer is really good and if you are looking for a small printer which is of this size and if you want to use it without home or office Wi-Fi network then you can use the inbuilt Wi-Fi of this printer and it's quite efficient you can do multiple scannings you can do printing with that simply you just have to connect your printer with any device it can work with the MacBook laptop or any any device which supports the Wi-Fi. Thanks for watching.